What is up, everybody? It's about Versity Rear today. And earlier today, I did a video saying how I thought I saw the most delusional Sony fanboy take about how early the guy says that Sony's going to own most of these big third party publishers. I thought that was one of the most crazy takes I've seen on this app. But, you know, it is, I don't know why I'm, I'm still shocked at this point about doing these videos. Sony fanboys continue to say the most delusional takes, and I think this take has to be worse than the other one I did earlier at this point, because this is a Sony fanboy getting asked for advice on which console to get, and a person apparently was asking about the Series S if that's a good console to get. He convinces this guy to buy a PS4 in 2022, and then he says, me actively talking to someone out of getting the Xbox, He'll thank me later. I'm doing the Lord's work, saving one victim at a time. How much of a fanboy can you be to to suggest somebody get some old technology like a PS4, which came out in 2014, to something that's new because it's on the, the platform that you don't like? It's just like, what is going on right now? But let's look at these tweets that that is just like, let's look, let's look, let's look how this transpired. So apparently the guy asked him, he says, I'm going for a Series S because the X is too expensive. Uh, and he says, what's your opinion? He says, it's a waste of money to buy Xbox Series X or S. Oh, LOL, I found an S for a good price. Should be for a cheap price. The X is $6.99. I said, no, nah, son. Now, I don't think he's in the U.S. because the Xbox Series X doesn't cost 700 bucks. So he must be like in a different country or something. They charge 700 or whatever. Then he says, you're better getting a PS5. I can't find one. I'd wait. Now, that would at least make a lot of sense. At least if you're going to tell them to get a PlayStation, at least tell them to get a PS5 and just wait for it to come in stock. But apparently he told, he convinced this guy to get a, um, I guess the next tweet says that. And he says, mission accomplished. As the guy says, I'm going to grab a PS4 Pro. Why? <laughs> Why would you get a PS4 Pro over an Xbox Series S? It's like the, the S loads faster. Unless you just want to play God of War, then I guess. But you're just going to you're just gonna sell that instantly to, to get a PS5. So it doesn't make any sense to get a lot of old technology when the new stuff is out right now. So I don't know. It seems pretty ridiculous. <laughs> it just see people responded to this tweet with because this just seems ridiculous. Like when the fanboys in Mazastron where you're telling people to buy old stuff instead of the new stuff that's out right now, really. Then this guy says, Does Sony pay you for this? <laughs> he isn't getting paid at all. Then he says, No, they don't have to. This is good good Samaritan work. I'm only here trying to save the world. Okay. If I'm making people buy by suggesting people buy old technology, old consoles, really. Wow, this is unbelievably cringe, OMG. <laughs> if life could always be worse was a person, this is what you do with your free time. LMAO, man, I would never complain about anything ever again. <laughs> I'm doing my part. They think they're actually like in this whole war. Like this war is just ridiculous. Bro, these senior citizens are here like acting like children. Bro, is a console we're almost at fifty. No life working hard for multi billion dollar companies for free, and who don't know you even exist? There's some weird people on this app. Some grown ass men. Oh man. So you talked him into buying an oversized, overpriced, underpowered console. So many dudes love paying more for less. And just the fact that we we we, all, we we constantly hear the narrative that the Xbox Series S is holding back current gen games, and he literally suggests somebody buy a PS4, like which is literally holding back gaming in that in that in that logic. It wouldn't that be holding back gaming to PS4? Jeez. Ah, uh, see, get a life. <laughs> Pretty weird and sad. I physically cringe. This is just sad. Uh, so desperate and rude. Mind your own business when it comes to how other people spend their money. This testimony was brought to you by the Church of PlayStation. <laughs> yep. This was going to my cringe compilation. 
I feel bad for you, to be honest. The fact this is bothering Xbox people so much is what's entertaining me in this thread. Really? The fact that you suggested somebody buy an old PS4 Pro instead of just buying some new stuff? Like, it, it doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> this guy says, smile, you're on Twitter versus TV. You already know how to make a video about this nonsense. When it's just this ridiculous to this point where people are literally suggesting you buy old or last gen console instead of a new console because that new console they're going to buy is the Xbox and they don't like Xbox. So it's like, really? It's just, it's just ridiculous. You've convinced them to buy a console that won't play any new games in two years. Yeah, so what is he going to do when Spider Man 2 comes out or when Wolverine comes out? He's going to sell that PS4 Pro and still be looking for a PS5 again. So he's been in the same situation he was in before. So this didn't help this guy at all. <laughs> it's just like a temporary solution that is not going to help anybody in the long run because he's going to have to sell that thing eventually to get the new stuff. So this doesn't make any sense. <clears throat> You can mess someone to buy a console that won't play any games in two years. Well play, you manage to completely rip someone off whilst pretending to help them. So even when you help, you still don't. And then put something on social media looking to, for praise. Don't do that. Uh, worse than writing a letter. <laughs> Congratulations on preventing someone from getting a product they would enjoy. You really are doing some kind of work. <laughs> I think that deserves a platinum a platinum pony trophy. You put in a maximum effort to convince someone not to game or anything not PlayStation. Congratulations. <laughs> this is so cringy at the end of the day. Like, jeez. All because you want to buy an Xbox system. He told him, nope, don't do that. But buy some a uh, last generation console. Like you can't make this up at this point. Like, jeez. <clears throat> I didn't think psychopathy was contagious, but here we are. Bro just won a next gen console and said he got a late last gen and that will hold him back from playing next gen only games like Plague Cell Requiem. This ain't it, Chief. If you want an Xbox, it's probably because of a game he heard of and a Game Pass. Like, I would support someone buying something they're interested in as long as it's a good deal. I have friends that play on all the systems, nothing wrong with any of them. Honestly, this is just sad, man. <laughs> Go get a life. Oh, man. That boy is punching the air right now, or maybe the PS4 is fan. And the slow load times for last gen as well. Like, why would you want to subject somebody to, to the load times for last gen? Sure, if you're only on last gen, you wouldn't know you wouldn't notice a difference. But if you plan the new stuff, you notice this is a big difference between how stuff just loads on new stuff or new hardware. So it just doesn't make any sense. This is just somebody play on some old consoles, of the new stuff. Just ridiculous. Mad corny. After all that, he bought a PS4 Pro. He could have bought both and experienced gaming as a whole. Because I'm pretty sure a PS4 Pro probably costs more than Xbox Series S, so he's probably spending more on that. Hello, this is Clownery. I see why your score is miserable. Okay. Uh, this is weird as a behavior. <laughs> uh, the only thing you did was steer them away from a great system and less BS than PlayStation. Cringy as F, bro. Sony is your lord. You are a dunce. <laughs> Bro made him get a crappy console when he could have gotten a Series S. Why get a PS4 or a Series S? I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. Why would you get a PS4 or a Series S? It doesn't make any sense. But you know. This dummy is obsessed with Xbox. No life has nothing to do. Instead of just deriding Xbox on Twitter, you need mental health, bro, or you're just playing. Okay. <laughs> I can't imagine being this much of a PlayStation you see there. Die hard. 
it's just like wow why <laughs> all this because this guy's a huge sony fanboy so there you go if you need advice on getting a gaming console or gaming advice don't go to fanboys for the answers because they're going to give you terrible advice like buying a last gen system instead <laughs> of some new stuff because hey maybe the only thing only new thing you can find is the, the xbox platform they're going to tell you about playstation from last generation so just wow just wow 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 at this point but i'm gonna include it right here definitely want to see your thoughts down below about this leave a like if you like this video and as always thanks for watching and peace